the, uh, the coaches, the coaching position is critical to the success of the FCA community. And notice I didn't just say FCA. When I say community, it's also the parents as well, the parents that are committed, the donors that are committed to the organization. Um, we spend a lot of time trying to, to develop our coaches. Uh, we see them as the foundation uh, to our success. Uh, I think the parents who have been a part of the organization, I think what you've seen over the years is consistency with our coaching staff. Uh, and it's because one of our missions uh, as we develop the, the organization is to make sure we're developing a younger uh, base of coaches as well. Uh, so on the sidelines, you're typically going to see an older coach, you're going to see a couple of younger coaches as well interfacing with the boys. But what we're trying to do is create that sustainable foundation that's critical to the mission and the vision uh, that we're trying to accomplish as, as an FCA organization. And just a, a, a statistic for you, 19 of the 45 coaches that are part of the organization or part of the coaching staff have actually played for an FCA team. So it's great to see those kids come back to the organization and participate with it. You'll also see the kids who have participated in the past outside of the Rochester area uh, become very involved with FCA organizations as well. Actually, it was Steve, I was talking with Steve Powell a bit. He was talking about his sons that have been a part of the organization. They're outside the area, but they're contributing uh, to other organizations. So. Uh, so just a bit about the, uh, the code of conduct. Let's talk about what the mission is of the coaches. Uh, our mission as coaches is to positively impact uh, the sporting world uh, through the use of bi biblical-based uh, character um, and uh, uh, character and values uh, as, we, as we coach the kids. One second here. So essentially what we're trying to do is we're trying to use lacrosse as, as the foundation, uh, as the environment for us to be able to positive, positively impact the kids. Our goal is to represent Christ uh, as we coach the kids. Okay. So for us, it's not just about winning. It's also about uh, improving, uh, improving the kids not just through lacrosse, but helping them uh, develop themselves into young, uh, into young men. Essentially, we've signed up to be role models. Um, we, de we need to demonstrate, uh, the, we demonstrate Christ's values on and off the field. Um, during the games, we, we, the expectation is, is that we're going to be professional on the field. Uh, when we're outside of the competition, we're going to be very, uh, we're going to represent ourselves professionally um, as well. A book that, um, that, actually I'd highly, that many of the coaches have read and actually I'd highly recommend um, that others read the book as well is Season of Life. Uh, it's by Jeffrey Marks. Uh, what the book is about, Jeffrey Marks was actually a ball boy for the Baltimore Colts. Uh, and he ends up writing uh, a book about Joe Ertman, who was a professional football player. And he talks about the challenges that Joe had through his life. And Joe actually is a very inspirational coach. He's had a great impact on youth sports um, as well. And one of the things he talks about is, is we coach the impact that we have on the kids. Um, and the impact we can have on the kids and what it really means to be to develop young men into men. And it's not just about winning, right? What he talks about is the fact, he talks about the relationships that we generate with one another, both as players um, as well as coaches. He talks about the importance of love. And one of the things that we emphasize with our coaches um, and the coaching staff is really our objective at the end of the day is, our job as coaches is to love our players, the objective of the coaches, or the objective of the players, is to love one another. And that's essentially what we're trying to accomplish uh, as coaches. Um, the, from a, uh, a parent-coach relationship standpoint, our commitments are, uh, 
We're fully committed to parents and the players, both on the field and off the field. Uh, feel free at any time to come up and, uh, and ask us questions uh, if you ever have them. Uh, but again, we appreciate your support. Uh, we look forward uh, to the upcoming season and, uh, and working with the kids. Thank you.